who that nation what it do we back on another video where we reacting to some sports stuff today we back in the sports world today we reacting to um anthony edwards we're trying to see how good is anthony edwards now before all you minnesota timberwolf fans come at me and say oh you need to st uh, study anthony edwards and know more about him I apologize in advance. I don't know much about them because I really don't follow Minnesota Timberwolf basketball. Only time I see them play is like if they're playing like my team, which is the Lakers. Oh, yeah, trendy team. Yeah, he's a Lakers fan. Oh, boy. But anyways, that's the only time I really like look at when they, if they playing them. You know what I'm saying? I have seen highlights of him dunking. I have seen him taking off on people. I, I see him hit um hit threes so like you know he he can definitely shoot the ball as well so I think a lot of people feel the same way how I feel about Anthony Edwards um as far as us trying to figure out if he's gonna take that next step into being a perennial All Star a superstar of the league a face of the league um that is yet to be seen but I, it it definitely looks like He's going to trend in the right directions. So right now, what I want to do is take a look at his points per game so far this season. And thus far, through this short NBA season, he's already averaging 25.9 points per game, 6.3 rebounds, and 3.5 assists. Now, I would say that's taking the step into the next direction. Um, so it's just that we got to... A lot of young good players in the league right now, so he he may be getting overshadowed. Um, you got um, Lamelo Ball going off right now, so they're really trying to establish him as the face of the NBA. I truly believe they love John Morant being the second up and coming star right behind him. I'm pretty sure everyone's about to write Zion Williams off. Not don't quote me on that. You know what I'm saying? I, I want to see Zion Williams do really well. But the weight gaining and the injuries is, is not looking like he's going to have a, uh, a long, promising NBA career. So now that we got the stats out the way, let's get back over to the highlights and let's judge it from there. Back to Russell. Anthony Edwards gets that looked like a... That was a good shot, but uh, was it a double? Y'all tell me. Let me go back. It wasn't a double. It's just like he took two steps. One, two, th dribble. I guess you get allowed to take two steps, so you're good. That wasn't a travel. Nice shot. That's, that's very under control. You know, Andrew Wiggins going at a mismatch and winning inside. Edwards. Finds an extra gear and kisses it off the glass. So this is quite the duel. Beverly so the another offensive rebound from Minnesota. Okay. And that time I need to check one more stat. I don't know their record. What is their record? Last seven games they played Oklahoma City twice. They did Let me see their record. Let me see their record real quick. Uh, Cause he plays for the 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 Minnesota Timberwolves, so I need to see they record. And for those who don't really care about they record and all that stuff, y'all go ahead and skip on ahead, dog. Skip on ahead, big dog. Uh, they're three and seven. All right, they're three and seven. They play the Lakers tomorrow. Okay, so that's what I'm talking about right there. We're gonna go back to the highlights, but what I'm saying is like the third, the the three and seven. Did get beat by Memphis. He's gonna have to win some ball games, man. It's cool to look nice scoring points, but you gotta win, or else they're gonna have, uh, nice take, or else guess what they're gonna have to do for him? They're gonna have to Wiggins him on up out of there. Y'all see where Wiggins is at. But he's nice, though. I ain't gonna lie, bro. He looked like a a wide receiver. 
as Anthony Edwards knocks down another shot there. Anthony's just 71%. He's got a smooth, smooth ball game, though, bro. Look at that. He's strong. He gets to the paint or he gets to the bucket at will. Got to find a way to slow down the Warriors' offense, though. They get a stop there. Edwards out front. And Ant with the flush. Well, Mike and Nora were just talking about Beasley with a rebound. He hella athletic. Oh. Edwards in open look for three. Shot. And he hey, say what you want. Curry. But D'Angelo Russell a has a really a nice game. And, the and I would really like to see him on a winning team. Nice roll right there. Anthony Edwards, the alley pass from D'Lo. That's that nice. Man, got up on Dang. That's you oh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. That was saucy. That was saucy. Uh, that was real saucy. Let me see that again. Let me see that hot sauce again real quick. Anthony Edwards, the alley pass from D'Lo hammers that one home. That's super saucy. That's super saucy. Showed up the handle and the finish, and he's got 37. Carl Anthony Towns on the bench a little bit too long. Edwards looking for 40, and he's got a 40 spot. Got a 40 bucket. Got a 40 piece. Career 40 a 40 ounce. For Anthony Edwards. Towns for three. Beverly with a rebound. Edwards for a career high. Gee whiz. So he's shooting the shit out of the three right now. So that's what y'all telling me. Edwards is shooting the living shit out of the three and getting to the bucket at will. It's official to me, bro. Minnesota Timberwolves, you guys are not the fans. This is not to the fans, by the way. To the organization, you guys are shitty. You guys are really shitty for always having these good players and wasting their career and letting them go. Look at Zach Levine. Look at Andrew Wiggins. And look at Carl Anthony Towns wasting his freaking career there. And they're getting ready to do the same thing with Edwards. Y'all let me know down in the comments what y'all think about that. And if y'all agree with me, if y'all don't agree, man. Let me know if y'all want to see me react to anything else. Till next time I'm out, peace.